Okay, I'm Tom McGuinness from McGuinness Farms. We live at uh, Frogmore, which is in the central Tablelands, I'd say, of New South Wales. We have two properties about um, 25 kilometres apart, and we run a self replacing merino flock uh, of a comprising of about 35,000 DSE. Um, so we, uh, we try and keep things. Um, very simple in our business. I think that's you know a real key to our management. Um, try and run you know simple uh, enterprises which we can manage well. Um, in regard to drought uh, management um, and planning, I think the most important thing for us in regard to um, drought is having a plan. So we know. Um, well before a drought occurs or a dry period that um, we know what our plan is and we and um, we have an understanding of what that is and we understand the economics of behind our, behind our plan so um, if the plan is to be feeding we have gone through the um, process of analyzing what our cost structures are around that and um, and then we simply uh, implement that plan and it takes a lot of the stress out of it because we don't have to make decisions um, you know, on the run as much. We, we simply have already made the decision and, um, and we just go about implementing that plan. Um, we find that works, works really well and it um, allows us to you know, focus probably maybe more on some of the important things in regard to that plan like um, you know, just the implementation. Um, and I think it's also really important to, um, to keep, uh, surround yourself with really positive uh, people who can have a um, sort of an uplifting effect on, you know, on how you're managing that and your mental, mental state at the, at the, uh, you know, during that period, because it can be tough. But uh, yeah, if you, if you surround yourself with happy, positive people who can uh, add not uh, detract, I think that uh, makes the whole process a lot easier.